This week is Fire Prevention Week with the theme, Learn the Sounds of a Fire. Now, this should always be working, meaning don't take the battery out when it's constantly beeping. While the smoke detector may not be able to stop a fire, it can save your life. Smoke detectors save lives. CO2 monitors save lives. This year, Fire Prevention Week is all about knowing what to listen for. Show your family what the alarm sounds like and what to do when they hear that sound. According to the U.S. Fire Administration, in 2019, there were more than 1.2 million fires with nearly 4,000 deaths, up 24% from 2010. Fire is one of those things, you know, some, some seasons we may have a lot, you know, some years we may have a lot, some years not so much, and it's just generally, you know, up and down. The annoying sound of a smoke detector should not be ignored. If your smoke detector or your carbon monoxide detector is beeping every 30 to 90 seconds, that means the batteries are dealt low and you need to replace the batteries out. Smoke detector batteries should be changed often and your family should have an emergency exit plan. In the bedroom, in the sleeping area of the house and on each level of the home. When you hear that sound, get out of the house, Close the windows and doors that you come by on your way out and call 911. Baton Rouge and St. George Fire say these tips are key to keeping your family safe. Our children do fire drills at school and we need to do those in the home as well. Even though the smoke detector is a small device, it's definitely a lifesaver. Now, the CO2 monitor is very similar to the smoke detector and has a beep activation when it detects carbon monoxide. However, unlike smoke, carbon monoxide is odorless, doesn't have a color, and is a silent killer. Now, if you're in need of either of those detectors, you can reach out to your local fire department.